All right, guys, welcome back to Outside with Shive. Today I'm doing an unboxing, and we're gonna put this thing together. It's a crawler multi-use cart. I got it for the West Virginia trip, so you stick around. We'll break this thing out of the box and put it together, see what she looks like. Stick with me, we'll get right to it. And the only thing that we need is an adjustable. So, there we go. Here's my adjustable. What do you think? That should do it. Let's open this bad boy. I'm just gonna dump it out here. Hopefully there's no little pieces that I lose. So here we go. Oh crap, there's little pieces. Let's see what we got here. Junk, junk, one wheel, two wheels, three wheels, junk, junk, four wheels. Alright. Here's a box of stuff. I don't know why that little stuff isn't in with this stuff. Probably shouldn't be doing this in the grass, but we're going to. So six of these. Five. Oh, there might be some instructions. Six. Maybe a sticker for the splitter. through which is awesome no cotter pins it's good stuff this bag open so that's all that is I gotta tighten this nut up there's a hole in this axle shaft that a bolt goes through so it's pretty simple and like I said it's it's nice there's an actual bolt going in there instead of like a cotter pin or something that normally would go in there so I'm gonna get these two axles put together and then we'll come back to the build. Beer. Oh crap, lost my beer. Bring a spare. So, put this somewhere where I ain't gonna spill it. All right, back to this. Get these nuts tight. I don't know why I got such a big adjustable. So 
also, I don't know if you can see something missing here. Something missing here, which I have them. They were installed, but apparently they weren't tight enough. So now I gotta put this stuff back on. on the inside. So I went and got a 24 millimeter socket. So we're going to tighten her up. A little bit looser. There we go. That'll do. Awesome. I'll flip her over, put it on the other side. Get this side all together. Washer, spacer, axle, spacer on the back side. Right there. like a pool handle here. All right, so this here goes right along the outside of this stuff. Something like that. So, they want you to put the bolt in the first hole. I don't really care for these wing nut things, but that's what they give you for now. Plastic wing nuts. I had to throw some lock washers in between there. These are like carriage bolts, so there's a square, square hole on the inside that the bolt goes into. Have you seen that? But it just hit me in the head. It's great. So, roll that square nut, square bolt in there. All right, that's hit me in the head, so I'll just rest it on my head. Put this other bolt in. care for these plastic nuts but maybe changing that down the road so this was already down in here in the box I don't know why they just didn't bolt it fast but it's supposed to pivot which it will a couple times right all right, like I said, this folds up, then you can take the top, loosen it up, and also fold it down. I'll do that right now for you. And this folds up like that. So, you're down to a fairly compact size. I'll throw it in the truck or whatever, you know what I mean? So max inflation is 30 PSI. We're gonna to go to 20 on all four of these. Seems like there's a tube in there. But they're supposed to be run flats also. So I don't know if you can see, but I did find a clip to keep this from folding. 
It doesn't come with these. I don't know why, but it doesn't. Archery target's pretty heavy. It's been out in the rain for a bit. I did forget a step, obviously. This webbing here needs to go behind this, this bolt. There we go. All right. So that's locked in. Webbing's on. Oh, how much is this way? Oh, this might be 60, 70 pounds. West Virginia deer aren't that big, so probably West Virginia deer there. Let's get this thing going over some bumps and stuff. See how good it works. hard turning which I mean there's four wheels you're trying to turn but look at that works just like my log trailer Let's try going on an angle put the anti-tip that works really nice anti-tip see how it goes oh yeah All right guys, well there you have it. It's the crawler, multi-use cart by Hawk. So I'm ready for West Virginia. Like I said, it's a multi-use cart. You can use it for firewood, you can use it for deer, you can use it to haul basically whatever you want to, up to 500 pounds. So if you like this kind of stuff, hit that subscribe button, leave a comment, tell your friends. I'll see you guys in the next one.